Have you ever had your mind blown? If not, I think it's time I've showed you something. Experts on a Japanese government panel have come up with a new idea to stop leaks of contaminated water at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. They say the ground, ground around reactor buildings should be frozen. About 400 tons of water a day is flowing into underground storage pools. Workers discovered last month that these pools were leaking water. The panel members want Tokyo Electric Power Company to freeze the ground to make a shielding wall around the buildings of four reactors. They say TEPCO should implement the measure by the middle of fiscal 2015. The experts also want the utility to pump up the groundwater from wells outside the buildings and release it into the ocean. They hope TEPCO can gradually reduce the flow of the water and stop it completely in eight years. The panel members also urged the government to help TEPCO maintain the frozen wall. Researchers have found the water near the seabed in the Pacific Ocean was still disturbed four months after the March 11th earthquake. They say this suggests a string of aftershocks changed the condition of the water. The researchers from the Japan Agency for Marine Earth Science and Technology used specialized cameras to explore the Japan Trench. They found a sediment was swirling over the seabed about 110 kilometers southeast of the quake's focus. The researchers say the seafloor at the depth of 7,000 meters or more is usually calm with weak currents. They say marine life there was abundant before the quake. But four months after the disaster, researchers spotted only a few species. They say this may be a sign that the quake affected the deep sea ecosystem. <laughs> 